That's right, you read the title, right? I'm not joking when I say there exists a format where Seeking is one of the best Pokemon. And no, it's not Little Cup plus Seeking. Let me introduce you to 35 Pokes, a format where only 35 random Pokemon are allowed each month, which leads to things like this happening. So how did Seeking go from this to this? Let's start with Seeking's competitive history. Don't worry, it's not very long. Although it was introduced back in Generation 1, back when there was no power creep, Seeking found little success. I mean, look at these stats. What the hell is this? Like the fish it is, it fell to the bottom of the barrel in PU, the lowest format. <laughs> this continued Generation 2, and in Generation 3 it dropped to the even lower bottom tier of ZU. There it could function as a potent offensive threat, using its new Swift Swim ability to abuse rain alongside cast form. It's telling that many of the other Pokemon mentioned in Sea King's analyses aren't even fully evolved. I mean, come on, this is a tier where other top mons are coughing and Lily. From there on out, Sea King simply isn't at all viable anywhere. It's not a good sign when a mon's Pokemon entries are jokes for multiple consecutive generations. And so, Sea King has since been resigned to irrelevancy, not even making the cut for Gen 9. At the beginning of the 35 Pokes March meta, Seeking fell to the wayside alongside the company of Fionn and Greedent. Meanwhile, Gallade was busy ravaging the tier with its sharpness boosted stabs, and the meta pretty much revolved around it. Despite that, Seeking's presence made me wonder about Rain as a possibility. The premier weather side at the time was Grafii, thanks to its ability Prankster. That was the only viable option except for. the Dark Guards. However, the course of the meta and the destiny of Sea King shifted when Gallade was banned after a suspect test. The format couldn't just continue for 3 weeks as 34 pokes, so Gallade's spot was re-rolled. The result? Politoed. Personally, I think the Gallade ban was a great development for the March meta, and that's not just because I'm a Sea King stan. Without Gallade going Virgil on everyone's ass, defensive play actually felt possible. After all, not everyone used Rain and wasn't an automatic win. Wookie boys like Swampert, Regiaist, and Ferrigarath finally had room to breathe and could withstand attacks. The preeminent defensive Pokemon of the tier, Weezing Galar, really took off without having to fear Psycho Cuts. However, you may notice that none of the defensive staples resist water. Enter the Rain Squad. Before I get into the star of the show, I want to go over the supporting cast. First, the Rain Frog itself, Politoed. Politoed of course gets up rain reliably, but is also a threat in of itself, able to launch powerful weather balls, hydro pumps, and scalds with ease. It also has the bulk to pull off the Whirlpool Paris song if you're of the devious sort. Then there's the primary special attacking water type, Tatsugiri. It turns out Tatsugiri doesn't have to pile Dundos like a Gundam to get stuff done, as its high power stabs let function like a mini Palkia O, kind of. Furthermore, it can set up nasty plot to nuke stuff or support its teammates with rapid spin. Truly, the snack would bite its back. After that, the options become a bit more niche. Cacturn can slurp up opposing water moves, remove everyone's items, and revenge kill with Sucker Punch. Horikoryu Sensu can set up quiver dances or just immediately spam accurate hurricanes. And Mr. Ground Immune can likewise spam Thunder. Now for the Star of Rain, Seeking. With rain boosted stabs, Seeking can take on even the sturdiest physical walls after a sword stance, even Galarian Weezing. Most physical attackers' moves simply bounced off of Weezing, but not Seeking. Basically nothing can withstand a plus 2 attack from Seeking thanks to its coverage of Megahorn and Knockoff, which hits things like Cacturn and Tatsugiri. It was also difficult to out-offense Seeking since it outran everything with Swift Swim. Really only Ninjas could reliably outrun Seeking, but that required protecting first, which is an easy opportunity to switch out. Seeking rarely ran choice items. Tatsugiri and Cacturn were common brings, so locking into a water move would allow them free entry. In my opinion, the most effective way to use Seeking was to soften the enemy team with the other 5 mods first, and then bring in Seeking to Sword Stance up and clean up the game. I mean, nothing is quite as satisfying as getting 4 kills in a row with Seeking. I won't pretend that Seeking is without weaknesses, even though it is a perfect entity. Firstly, it needs Rain up to be useful. That Rain is simply too slow and too frail to get much done, so Politoed is mandatory. Seeking doesn't appreciate Tatsugiri's Storm Drain and Cacturn's Water Absorb since it ideally wants to use Waterfall, so you have to be wary of those. It's also weak to priority moves like Sucker Punch, which make Cacturn in particular a real thorn in its side. Seeking is also prone to getting worn down. It needs Life Orb to maximize its power, but this makes it weak to hazards, which is why I think it works best coming in as a cleaner. All this being said, Seeking is unironically one of the best offensive threats of the 35 Pokes March meta. It started out at the bottom, but Glinking replaced by Politoed gave it a place in the metagame. 
Although it has some shortcomings, DK is probably the scariest late game threat thanks to its exclusive access to Swift Swim. It may be a niche format, but Seeking finally found a place to thrive. If you want to learn more about the 35 Pokes format, check out the video I made going over it. If you want to try out the new April meta, I've linked the Discord server in the description. Since you've stuck around, consider liking and subscribing so the story of Seeking's success can spread throughout the seven seas. Thank you so much for watching my analysis of Seeking, and I hope you enjoyed seeing the little guy succeed just as much as I did.